Today I'm going to show you guys how to get a better arch for all the dancers out there. I'm going to show you some at home exercises and tips. The first thing you'll need is a ballet shoe. If you have the elastic shoes, then that's really good because they're a flexible shoe. If you have the ribbon ones, don't go with those because they're a rather firm shoe. So if you don't have the elastic ones, just go with a pair of socks instead. The next thing you'll need is a stair band. I prefer fitness bands, like a warm-up band, because I feel like it's less tense on my feet. But this works the exact same as their band. Now the last thing you will need is a tennis ball or a golf ball to roll out your arch. Um, cause if you don't, it can cause some serious cramping in your feet if you do not um, relax and massage your foot muscles before these exercises and after. The first exercise we'll be doing it does not require any equipment. So what you're gonna do is be going up on Jenny po Jemmy Point and putting down your foot in all the five ballet positions. If you want to know how to do the positions, just comment down below. So I'm just gonna do it. I just like to do it five times in every position. So I'm just gonna do that. The next exercise is just flexing and pointing. So you can alternate your feet if you want to. Or you can just do them all together. Um, it's your choice to choose on how many times you would like to do this. Every day I prefer, if I'm alternating, I prefer to do at least 30 on each foot. If I'm doing it at the same time, it'll just be 30 again because I don't like to overdo it with my feet because then your feet do get stiff and they do tend to cramp up if you aren't careful. You can also stand up and point. I prefer standing up rather rather than sitting down. The next exercise requires your clear band. Here's the tip. You can either wear socks, you can go barefoot, or you can just wear the tights with the feet on them when you're doing this exercise. However, do not wear ballet shoes. They are way too thick to be used with the TheraBand. So, you're going to place the TheraBand on your feet. Make sure you're holding it tight so you actually feel a stretch. Um, this will help strengthen your arch. You're just going to flex. You're going to place it on the middle of your foot right here. So you're going to flex and point and you're just going to flex and then you can point and pull you can alternate feet you can choose how many flexi flexing and pointing you want to do and this helps your feet a lot more than not using the theraband because you are putting a bit of tension so your feet can get a lot stronger most importantly, I hope you guys enjoyed this video and stay tuned for the next one. Bye! Oh, and I almost forgot. Go ahead and check out my other channel, Danny Sparkles. And don't forget to subscribe to that channel and this one. Bye!